Hi everyone, it's Judy Parsons, the LinkedIn lady, and today we're looking at the LinkedIn messaging inbox. Now, did you know that we actually have two messaging um, inboxes on LinkedIn? I don't know if you've ever noticed, but we actually have obviously your main one, uh, which you get when you click on the messaging tab up here on your LinkedIn navigation bar. But if you go to these three dots here, can you see, if I click on that, there's also a message request inbox. And sometimes if somebody sent you a message using this particular inbox, you'll um, get a message at the top, uh, sort of up here somewhere, that says that you've had a message request. So let's just have a little look at that message request inbox. So basically, messages requests are people are from people that you're not connected to because on LinkedIn, if you want to send messages to people, you have to be directly connected to them. But these people haven't connected with you and they're able to send you a connection request using either LinkedIn groups or events. So you can see via here, via, um, this is how these people have actually uh, managed to uh, connect with me. And when you look at these, you know, they are always, always these salesy rubbish message that you probably never want to get at all. So we look at Patrick here, he sent me, you know, my agency helps over 500 businesses. So they're just, these are just people who go, we're just throwing stuff out there. They hasn't bothered looking at my website. They're not there to try and create relationships. They just want to, um, you know, want, want, want us to, um, you know, sell to us basically. And who wants to be sold to? Nobody. So what we can do with these, um, if, if this was on your main messaging inbox as well, um, I haven't got any messages on my main inbox that I would want to get rid of. So I'm using my uh, message request uh, inbox to demonstrate how this works. But let's just assume Patrick had messaged you on LinkedIn. It gone straight through to your, your default LinkedIn inbox and you're going, Patrick, you're selling to me. I don't want to know you. Bugger off. If you excuse my French, what we're going to do is we're going to click on these three dots up here and you'll see that we've got a number of options here. And at the bottom, we've got report and block. So we click on block. We've got enough, a number of options here that you could go. I don't know, Patrick. It's spam. It's inappropriate, etc, etc. So we're going to tell LinkedIn why we're reporting this conversation. So we're going to go with it's a scam. I mean, you can choose any of these. If you just want to click on them, you can see um, why, you, you know, the options that you've got there. But if we click on it's spam or, or a scam, if we click on that, we can tell LinkedIn what we think it is. And it is, it's promotional or spam. And we don't want it. So we're going to click on submit and LinkedIn then thanks us for reporting it. Whether they do anything with it is another matter, but at least we've uh, we've done that. Um, if you were connected with uh, Patrick or you, know, you never want to see or hear from him again, <clears throat> then you can also block him from here, as you can see. I'm not actually connected to uh, Patrick and he doesn't have a scooby who I am. He's just throwing stuff out there to see what uh, kind of sticks. So we're going to get rid of that. So let's just go back to our main inbox. So you can see that I'm in the message request inbox still. If I click on go to inbox, that's going to take me back to my main um, messaging inbox. And you can see again, we actually in your main inbox on LinkedIn, you still got the three dots here where you can go in and report and block should you wish to. And of course, the other really exciting thing we've got now is this star feature. So you can now uh, feature important or star important um, messages, which is a real uh, opportunity, I think, because you know, important messages can get lost on LinkedIn. So you should see um, against all your messages, a little star at the top right of the message that you can turn on and off. On and off, put <laughs> my teeth back in. Anyway, hope that was useful. Hope you enjoyed that. Any questions, please let me know.